A guide to self-injection. Bucerolin injections. Bucerolin comes in a multi-dose vial containing liquid. To be able to inject yourself with bucerolin, you will require one mil syringes, yellow needles, alcohol wipes, and a sharps bin. These items may be given to you by your clinic, or they may have been obtained as a kit from Pharmasure. Check the expiry date on the pack and do not use the product if it has expired. To give a single injection, first wash your hands and find a clean place to set out the items you need. One syringe, one yellow needle, an alcohol wipe and the vial of bucerolin. First remove the plastic flip top from the vial of bucerolin. Break the seal of the packaging on the needle. Next, remove the syringe from its packaging and attach the yellow injection needle to the syringe, keeping the protective cover in place over the needle. Then, using the alcohol swab, wipe the rubber top of the vial. Remove the protective cover from the needle and, inverting the bucerolin vial, Push the needle through the rubber seal. Slowly withdraw the plunger so that the brucerolin solution begins to fill the syringe. As the needle is very fine, the brucerolin comes out quite slowly. Ensure you withdraw a little more brucerolin than you intend to inject. Your clinic will have told you how much brucerolin to inject Slowly push the plunger back up until the required amount is in the syringe. In this case, we are injecting 0.5 mil. There should be no air in the syringe. After ensuring there is no air in the syringe, by pointing the syringe upwards and pushing the plunger until a tiny droplet appears at the end of the needle, the injection is ready to be given. You are now ready to give the injection, which must be done immediately. Your specialist or nurse may have advised you on a suitable site for injection. Good areas to perform a subcutaneous injection are the tummy or the front of the thigh. At your chosen site of injection, pinch the skin together firmly and insert the needle at an angle of between 45 degrees and 90 degrees Injecting under the skin, taking as much time as needed to inject all the liquid. Do not inject into a vein. Withdraw the needle. You have now successfully given your first injection. Dispose of the used syringe, needle and any empty vial in the sharps bin. Do not close the lid of the sharps bin until you have completed your whole course of treatment, at which time you should dispose of the sharps bin as you have been advised by your clinic. Please ensure that you store the sharp spin safely out of the reach of children. Remember to store your remaining bucerolin for your next injection.